Jens is the world leader in catalysis, I would say. He, he has the vision and the conceptual idea to bring that whole field forward. And Jens gave a presentation about uh, how to describe how molecules are atoms, bonds on surfaces, and he had uh, developed some very clever way of describing that bond uh, using, at that time, very simple models. And I was very impressed by his conceptual outlook, how, what he was after, what type of problems he was trying to solve. So it's going to be a partnership, I think, for many problems, ranging all, all the way from understanding how we could do artificial photosynthesis, uh, to regular catalysis, understanding chemical bonds in a very conceptual ideas and also including water which is a topic that I'm very excited about and Jens also started to make some really important contributions. Stanford is going to benefit tremendous from Jens being here and they also Stanford might be able to see the enormous let's say collection of people that will come with Jens as well. He would have an enormous impact in making Stanford potential center in US for catalysis research. Uh, and catalysis is broader in, in the context, context of energy chemical transformations. Because I believe that Jens is going to be one of them that actually might provide the key ingredients in, in a very deep understanding that actually might lead to solving, partially solving the energy problem because the energy problem is going to be strongly connected with formation and cre creation and uh, uh, transformation of chemical bonds. For all his work in catalysis, uh, he will eventually get the outermost, most prestigious award you can get in science. My first thought was, was to talk about all your outstanding qualities as a researcher and as a leader and as a person. But then I uh, thought of something else instead, so what I would like to say is that uh, to me you're really uh, my mentor and uh, and when I uh, grow up I would like to be a nurse school chair uh, and when you left from here it was really like, um, to me it was really like when parents on holiday leaving the house to the kids and uh, in that respect I would like to say uh, here everything is fine please send more money we have already spent what you what you left behind so Jens congratulations and see you dear Jens I would also like to congratulate you on your appointment to the Edwards chair I view this as a well-deserved recognition of your unique contributions to catalysis and computational science in general. Scientifically, I've always been very impressed at your ability to stay ahead of the field and to identify the areas where you could push the boundaries of science. Personally, I've also benefited greatly from your ability to delegate responsibility. This of course means that you may occasionally end up in charge of larger projects than you anticipated. I still remember a brainstorming meeting in connection with our KMD Summer School in Electronic Structure Theory and Materials Design, where I mentioned the idea of having a joint research project for all the students. You replied, that's a great idea, why don't you organize it? It being the simulations and contributions to the paper from more than 100 students afterwards. With this, Jens, I would like again to congratulate you and wish you all the best. I hope we may continue our excellent collaboration in the years to come. Jens, I'd like to congratulate you on this day uh, when you will be the Edwards Professor of Chemical Engineering. Um, and I think it's an honor for both SLAC and the university that you are here. And uh, we are all looking really forward to the exciting future